Hey there everyone and welcome. Uh, today I'm going to show you my entire Madonna collection. It's been 10 years since I uploaded the first video of my then Madonna collection. It was February 2011. So I kind of wanted to uh, make a 10th anniversary edition of that first video of course 10 years have passed and my collection has became uh, bigger uh, three more albums have been released since then so let's get into it let's find out what do we have here first I have Madonna, her, f her first album, then I have Like a Virgin, then I have True Blue, these past three CDs are the remastered versions that were released in 2001. This is True Blue, the Super Club mix. This is really cool because this one um, this one has the instrument, instrumental version of Live to Tell, which I love. Um, this is the Super Club of La Isla Bonita. This one is really cool as well because it has Gambler which is a song that was recorded for the Vision Quest soundtrack. Then I have the Who's That Girl soundtrack. Then I have You Can Dance. This remix album is really good. Then I have my second favorite Madonna album, Like a Prayer. Then I have uh, Remixed Prayers. This is sort of like an EP. Uh, it has eight remixes of Like a Prayer and, and Express Yourself. My favorite one is the Nonstop Express mix of Express Yourself. It's really good. Then I have the maxi single of Keep It Together. Then I have I Am Breathless. This one's really good. Uh, then I have the maxi single of Vogue. I love the single version of Vogue. It's really good. It's way shorter than, than the original version. Then I have Hanky Panky. Maxi single. And then here comes the iconic Immaculate Collection, Madonna's first greatest hits album ever. I love this album. It's brilliant. Then I have the Holiday Collection EP. It's from England. It's just four tracks. Three of them could not make it onto the set of the Immaculate Collection. Uh, then I have Justify My Love, the Maxi single. This one's very cool because it contains the Beast Within mix, which was used as an intro, intro for the uh, Reinvention Tour in 2004. Then I have Rescue Me, the Maxi single. I love the Titanic vocal mix. Of this song is really good. And then I have Erotica, one of my favorite albums from the 90s. It's brilliant this record. I wish I had the sex book though. Unfortunately I don't. This is the Erotica Max a single. Then here we have Deeper and Deeper, the maxi single. 
Then I have um, Bad Girl, the maxi single. This one is very interesting because it's just two tracks of Bad Girl and the rest of them it's Fever. Uh, I thought this one contained the video version of Fever, but unfortunately it does not. It's cool though. Then I have Rain, maxi single. Uh, this one is very interesting as well because it contains uh, Uptown Suite, which is a kind of like a, an extended version, extended version of an unreleased Madonna song called Goodbye to Innocence, I guess. That song is really good. Then I have Bedtime Stories. I love this album, it's really good. Survival and and Bedtime Story are my favorite tracks from it. Then I have Secret, the maxi single. There's a version of this single that contains an unreleased song called uh, Let Down Your Guard. Unfortunately, this one does not contain that song. Battle for me. Then I have Take a Bow, the uh, maxi single. I love the artwork of Bedtime Story and its singles. Then I have Bedtime Story, the maxi single. This one contains the Orbital Mix, which was used for the live version of the Reinvention Tour, which I love. Then I have Human Nature, maxi single. And then... Here comes one of my favorite Madonna CDs ever. Her greatest ballad compilation. It's called Something to Remember. This one is really good. It contains This Used to Be My Playground and I Remember, which are not featured in any uh, Madonna studio album. Then I have You'll See, the maxi single. This one's really cool because it contains a live version of Live to Tell from the uh, Who's That Girl world tour. Then I have the Evita soundtrack. It's the standard edition, one CD only. I do not have the two CD version. I don't know why. Uh, then I have the uh, Don't Cry For Me Argentina maxi single. Oh, my hands are too sweaty. Do you see it? Then I have my favorite Madonna album ever. And it's Ray of Light. I love it so much. Uh, Nothing Really Matters and The Power of Goodbye are my favorite tracks from this album. Then I have Frozen, the maxi single. Then I have Ray of Light, maxi single. Uh, the uh, William Orbit Liquid mix, it's really good. It's my favorite one from here. Then I have um, The Power of Goodbye, it's the CD single. Then I have Nothing Really Matters. The CD single. Um, then I have music. Uh, this version does not contain American Pie. I think it's the US version. It's the original album. Then I have uh, music. The Maxi single. I don't like that much the remixes from the song uh, then I have Don't Tell Me the maxi single then I have What It Feels Like For A Girl the maxi single this one contains the Spanish version it's called Lo Que Siente La Mujer then I have Madonna's second greatest hits album it's called GHV2. Uh, most Madonna fans don't like this album, but I think it's really cool. I like it. 
Some people say it's dull because it didn't feature any to any new songs, but I think it's cool. The artwork is is fantastic. Um, this is Die Another Day, the maxi single. And then here comes my first Madonna CD ever. This is the first Madonna CD I ever got. It's American Life. It's also one of my favorite ones. It was uh, summer 2003. I was 13 years old. I still remember it. Then I have American Life, the Maxi single. Then I have Hollywood, the Maxi single. Then I have Nothing Fails, the Maxi single. Then I have Love Profusion, the Maxi single. This one contains a remix that is called the Passengers Club Profusion. It's probably my favorite Madonna remix ever. I love it. Then I have Remixed and Revisited. This one's really cool. I mean, it's just seven tracks, but it has um, an unreleased song called Your Honesty. I think it was from her Bedtime Stories period. Then I have uh, my third favorite Madonna album, Confessions in a Dance Floor. This was the first Madonna album I had the opportunity to witness. Um, I was in high school. It was 2005, I guess. Yeah, I was 15 years old. Wonderful memories with this album. Wonderful. And then I have Hung Up, the Maxi single. This one has very cool remixes. I like it. Then I have Sorry, the Maxi single. Uh, then I have Get Together, the Maxi single. Um, and then I have Jump, the uh, Maxi single. This one's really cool because it has an unreleased Madonna song that it's called History. I love that song. Then I have I'm Gonna Tell You Secret, CD and DVD. I love this one. And I love the movie. Then I have Heart Candy. I love this album. And then I have Madonna's third greatest hits album, Celebration. This one's very cool. I love it. I wish I had the vinyl version. And now let's move to the to some special editions and DVDs. Here I have the special edition of Confessions in the Dance Floor. Then I have the special candy box edition of Hard Candy. Then I have the Madonna Ciao Italia Live from Italy concert DVD. Then I have the Immaculate Collection DVD. Then I have the uh, Girl Show, live from Australia, live down under, DVD. Then I have the video collection, 93.99. Then I have the music DVD single.
Then I have the uh, Drowned World Tour. This is live from Detroit, I guess. Yeah. Uh, then I have the uh, DVD uh, box version of I'm Going to Tell You a Secret. It's, it has exact exactly the same content of, as the CD box, but I don't know. I wanted to have the two versions. Then I have the Confessions Tour DVD. This is a wonderful, wonderful concert film. I love it. Then I have a Celebration, the video collection. Uh, then I have the MDNA World Tour DVD. And I also have the deluxe version of the of the MDNA World Tour DVD. It has it 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 contains one DVD and two two CDs. And then let's move on to the Blu-rays. I have Truth or Dare. Then I have the uh, Sticky and Sweet Tour. Blu-ray plus CD. Then I have the MDNA World Tour Blu-ray. And then I have the Rebel Heart Tour Blu-ray. Now let's continue here. I have I have I still have a lot more. <laughs> uh, first I have the Everybody CD single. Then I have uh, the standard version of Like a Virgin. This is not the remastered version. Then I have the Like a Virgin CD single. Oh. Then I have Angel. CD single. Then I have uh, Into the Groove and Who's That Girl. This is a rare version. Uh, then I have Open Your Heart. Um, then I have Like a Prayer. This is the Japanese version of Like a Prayer. Then I have Erotica. Then I have Betam Story. These are German CD singles. Then I have The Power of Goodbye. Uh, then I have Drowned World. Substitute for love. Uh, then I have nothing really matters. I got this one in Paris in the Lucky Records store. Then I have Beautiful Stranger. I got this one in Paris too in Lucky Records. I recommend you to go to that store in Paris. If you get the chance to go to Paris, go and find um lucky records it's it's pretty much a uh, madonna music store then i have american pie then i have don't tell me then i have the uh, limited edition the special limited edition of ghv2 i love this one I still have the shrink wrap. Then I have the Japanese version of Confessions on a Dance Floor. These two Japanese versions of Confessions and Like a Prayer, I got them uh, at Madonna's Rebel Heart Tour. Then I have um, the Confessions Tour CD and DVD.
then I have um, Four Minutes, the maxi single. Then I have Give It To Me, the maxi single. Then I have uh, Miles Away, maxi single. Uh, now this is the standard edition of Celebration, just one CD. Uh, then I have, once again, the US version of the two CD of Celebration. Then I have the maxi single of Celebration. This is the Revolver Maxi Single. And this is the uh, Sticky and Sweet Tour CD and DVD. And now I have the complete studio albums box set. Then I have MDNA, the deluxe version of MDNA. Then I have the standard edition of MDNA, just one CD. Then I have Gimme All Your Lovin' CD single. Then I have Girl Gone Wild. The remixes. This one's really good. Eight remixes. I love it. Then I have the uh, MDNA World Tour 2 CD edition. Then I have the clean standard version of Rebel Heart. This cover is my favorite one from the three that she made. Then I have the deluxe version of Raven Heart. This is probably my least favorite uh, cover. Then I have Living for Love, City Single. And then I have Ghost Town, City Single. And the super deluxe version of Rebel Heart. This one contains two CDs. And the songs on the second disc, uh, Beautiful Scars, Burrow Time, Addicted, and Graffiti Heart, I love them. I truly love them. Then I have the Rebel Heart World Tour CD and DVD. Then I have the Rebel Heart Tour 2 CD edition. Uh, then I have the Madame X Deluxe version. I got this in HMV in London. Uh, this one was not available in, in Mexico, so I got the chance to travel to London and, and, and saw this and, well, and I bought it immediately. And then I have the standard edition of Madame X. And over here, I have the Supper Deluxe version of Madame X. Uh, a friend of mine from France bought this for me. I love it. Okay, now let's move on to the vinyls. Okay, now let's move on to the vinyls. This is these are all the the vinyls that I have. Uh, let's start with Madame X. Rebel Heart. Uh, 
confessions on the dance floor. American Life. Music. Ray of Light. Something to remember. Bedtime stories. Erotica. The Immaculate Collection. Like a prayer. I keep them all sealed because I do not have a record player. I wish I could buy this. I, I could buy it this year. Uh, True Blue. Like a virgin. Madonna, the first album. The uh, maxi single of Sorry. Like a virgin single. Vogue uh, This is another copy of like a virgin um, My best friend bought me this from Germany Like 10 years ago uh, This is the uh, exclusive blue vinyl from the record store day of True Blue. Uh, this was released in 2019, I guess. Yeah, I guess so. With this one, the green, exclusive green vinyl of La Isla Bonita. These two were released at the same time. I hope I'm not wrong. Um, then I have a uh, celebration. Holy uh. celebration. Um, then I have revolver. Yeah. And I think that's all. And here is where I keep the um the true books well i keep uh stuff from other artists that i love to oh well this is the l magazine from 2008 and i also have a rolling stone magazine as well uh this is the uh sticky and sweet tour book the mdna world tour book and the uh, Rebel Heart Tour book and I think that's all so this was my entire Madonna collection uh, thank you for watching I hope you enjoyed this video and let me know in the comments below how many items how many Madonna items do you have? Bye!